Welcome back to the channel. My name is Abel and welcome back to Uncharted 2 Among Thieves. Sile is back and we're in Borneo. We've made the trip from Istanbul and we're now in Borneo. So last time Drake and Flynn, Harry Flynn, uh, were in Istanbul breaking into the museum uh, looking for uh, an old Mongolian oil lamp which had information about Marco Polo's lost fleet. What um, Drake didn't realise was Marco Polo actually found uh, the lost city of Shambhala, also called Shangri-La. And, um, you know, that's what that's what Drake has found out and Flynn's found out. Uh, but unfortunately, after picking up this uh, info and trying to get out, Flynn double-crossed Nate and Drake got uh, captured by cops, by Turkish authorities, and was thrown in jail for three months. So luckily, Sully has bailed us out. Chloe's with us and she's working on the inside uh, with Harry Flynn and Flynn's uh, client is Zoran Lazarevich, a Serbian war criminal who is after the uh, the treasure. He's after Marco Polo's lost treasure. He's a fortune hunter himself. So here we are in Borneo. We are heading into Lazarevich's camp looking for his files on Marco Polo. Chloe is going to set up a distraction uh, with explosions and not with being hot. But let's let's crack on and jump forward. So this is what we're looking for here. There's four of these around, and this is the first one. Uh -huh. There we are. All right. First one set. Don't touch the button. This one. <laughs> yeah, don't press that button just yet, Sally. Once you've set all the charges, just hit the detonator, and it's showtime. <laughs> They'll never know what hit him. Just be careful. Zarovich has got his men posted all around the perimeter. Alright. Guess we're going up that way, but if I follow this, surely this will lead to a treasure of some sort. Surely. Or not. Oh yeah, there we go. I think we have to shoot that one down. There we go. I forget some of them are in the air sometimes. What do we get? We got a Yuan Dynasty coin or Dynasty. So yeah, there are some treasures high up which you've got to remember. You got a bit of an itch, Tully. You are doing okay. All right, up we go. Ooh, parrots. Borneo is like a dream location for me. I'd love to go to Borneo. I'm sweating like a hooker in church. You brought a hooker to church? Why not? Oh, Sully. Oh, I hear voices. Hey, careful. Up ahead. Don't let him spot you. Let's take these guys out. Quiet. Is there a quiet, mate? That's the other end of loud. Oh, headshot straight away. Okay. Oh, wow. That gun sensitivity is a bit. I got like a headshot on the first time. Are you dead? No, you are. Sally, I think he's dead. Oh, no. There's another one. Okay. Um, Is there a crouch button or is it just be stealthy? Maybe there isn't one. I, don't, I, I forget. Honestly, I forget. Okay, they are dead. I'm probably going to take these out stealthily, but I forgot what buttons were what. Are you dead? No, you're not. Now you are. Right. Can I turn down this sensitivity? Because it's a bit mad. Oh, it's a bit low, if anything, maybe. I don't know. I never really understand sensitivity in games. I think I said that in another game I played. But I don't think there is a crouch button in this. Oh, wait. Is there someone else? Oh, yeah, there is. Oh, down he goes. Right, I think we're okay. 
we have another gun or is it just going to be pistol at the moment? Looks like it's just going to be like pistols. There. <laughs> Maybe you can. That's where we're All heading. Right, hold on, Grandpa. See if I can find another way up. Just want to look for some ammo first of all. There might be some around. But I think we've, we've just got the handgun at the moment. I think there's... Yeah, there's no other guns just yet. So, we'll move ahead. Uh, oh, no, there is. AK-47. There we go. Okay. Uh, I think we have to knock this over. Yeah, we do. There we go. Come on, Drake. Use your strength. You've been hitting the gym. You must have done something to keep yourself busy while you were in prison for three months. Alright, he's up. Nate, you should be approaching excavation site one by now. Okay. Should have been back by now. Shit, we've been spotted. Oh shit. Come on, let's not die just yet. There we go. I wonder how long I can go before dying or without dying. A little bit of blind fire. Alright, things going okay so far. We'll stick with the handgun for now. We're getting lots of uh, lots of ammo for it, so we'll we'll stay on it. Uh Okay. I've planted four more charges in there, but you're going to have to clear the place out before you can arm them. Uh. What are you doing? Am I meant to be doing this? Oh, well, whatever that was. I don't know. I don't know if I was meant to do that or not. Okay, down we go. Ready for this? We've Let's do it. The what else does he expect to find? Don't let Lazarevich hear you talking like that. Okay, bit of stealth involved now. Huh? Right, now there's one of them went up that way. He's coming, so we can we can snag him as he comes around the corner. <laughs> or not. Oh yeah, and they blow up, I'm sure. There we go. Bit of pyro. Right. More enemies are going to come from that way, so let's just stock up for now. I think one of the charges is around here as well. Might be. I think it's over there. Uh, yeah, okay, let's go this way. Right, now I think we'll go for the AK. Oh, okay, there's the first death. Um, yeah, that gun is really sensitive. Like, the movement's really sensitive. Right, we get another chance at this. Oh, where's that? Oh, God, it's right on top of me. Shite. Oh, God. Ah, damn it. <laughs> okay, two deaths. Oh, that grenade landed right on top of me. Right. Blow that up. Oh, oh god, I just, I've still got the waste gun. That was a waste. Alright. Oh, we've got six more. Okay, that's good. We'll stick with the uh, AK for now, though. Oh god, okay. <laughs> that grenade keeps landing on me. Oh 
Right, let's go up here. Oh, it's... Okay, there we go. Uh, right, I think we're good. I'm thinking we grab the ammo, and maybe retreat, or we just keep going. Missed. There we go. Right, let's track back here, get some health back. I like the sound. I don't know what gun Sully has, but it's good. Sully, can we swap guns? What do you have? I think you've got a Wes as well. I think you've got the same gun. It's good. It's like a, it, some things it can kill in one shot. Or some people it can kill in one shot. Right? Okay. Right. I think we probably could have blown that up. Yeah, we could. Okay, I can see one of the explosives there. So we'll we'll load that one. We'll charge that one. Still got to arm three of the charges. Uh, yeah, we'll get the defender back. Uh, shotgun. We'll go for a shotgun. Uh, here's another charge. There should be only two left. Okay, are they all in the same area then? Are they all here? Are they elsewhere? I don't actually remember exactly where they are. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll stick with a shotgun for now, I think. Uh... Maybe one down here, no. No, we might have to go a bit further on for the other ones. Go up the, up the ladder? Can we get up the ladder? I think we need a boost. Come on, kid. Quit screwing around. We I ain't screwing around. Fight. Okay, there must be two more in this in this area then. Maybe the back this way. I think. Was oh, that one on the other side of there? Yeah, it is. That wasn't there before, I swear. It must have just come up. All right, one more. We're out of here. All right, there's one more. Where is it? Yeah, they weren't there before. They didn't show up anywhere. Okay. Now we have all four. Alright, so now we go to the ladder. And we get into the middle of the camp. And we use that explosion as the the diversion, as the distraction. Come on, Gorgeous. Jump up Got a great ass, Sully. Thanks. There you go, kid. Right, up we go. Must have been some tsunami to wash these ships so far inland. Looks deserted. More pi I almost called them pigeons then. Parrots, more parrots. Pigeons, where are we? London? Alright, there's nothing here. Go this way though. Get down. The pop is down again. Uh, the damn thing is always breaking down. Come on, let's just fix it so we can get out of here. Look, they're not armed. Well, not that many. What are we waiting for? We can take these guys. I don't know, Sully. Maybe. Uh oh. <laughs> There's another one of them. Here we go. We've got some melee because uh, we've lost our gun. So a little bit of a uh, melee combat here. I got some for you. Oh yeah, you can counter. They'll go for a punch sometimes, and you can um, you can counter their attack. Oh! Here's another one for you. 
It's good to know because it sort of does slow motion when he's about to attack you. Sully's just feeding us enemies at that point. Good question. I actually don't know. <laughs> I don't know what frivol frivol I frivolous. I don't know what frivolous means. I've heard the word before, but I don't know what it means. All right, up we go. What do you bet we follow the hose? We find the camp. You can we climb up the there? Hose. We can. Just like in Montreal, huh? You're never gonna forget that, are you? Uh, are we going the wrong? Oh, we're going back the way we came, I think. I thought there might be a treasure, but I think that's just going back the way we came. All right, over we go. Now we said, Sully said follow the hose. So I guess if we follow this, we'll get there. Okay, the dig. So again, looking for any treasure, not going out of the way to find it though. There's Chloe. Three months and you have found nothing. That's Lazarovich. Well, well, now wait, wait a minute. We've been commander. It must be Lazarovich. This man was caught stealing artifacts from site number five. <laughs> you would betray me for this? No, no, Zoran, I can't explain. No, no, need, no need. I am surrounded by traitors and fools. What do you say we really ruin this guy's day? Do it. Brenna, search the perimeter. Go! Alright, it's all yours, kid. I'll cover you from here. So if Lavo Zav L L L L I'll try it again. So if Lazarovich does that to his team, what does he do to uh to his enemies? Right, there's a couple of people still here. Right, attack from cover. That gets rid of you. Alright, we'll try and stealth this if we can. We'll stick with a shotgun though. Oh no, we don't have another weapon. We lost our weapons. Right. Now, Sully said he found a sniper rifle, which is handy. Right. Nobody over that way. Get rid of you. Right, there's one there. I don't see anybody else. Might only be the three. Wait for him to turn his back and we maybe go around that way. There might be something hiding behind that though that I can't see. Let's see if he moves. Or is he just going to stay there? Would you like to move? Would you like to turn around? Oh, that's handy. He didn't see me anyway. Oh, we might... I think we might have caught his attention. <laughs> Go on, Sully. Go on, Sally. Oh, nice. <laughs> that was amazing. I didn't actually know that he'd shoot him. Did you have a gun? Oh, you did. Right, the last one is over there. I might not even need to kill him. I oh, know you do. 
Done. Stealth achieved. Right, we'll, we'll load up on ammo before we crack on. Get that AK ammo. I think that might be everything. I think we're good. Alright. Up we go. What do we got here? Another Wes gun. Yes. We'll take it. Man, this Lazarevich guy isn't screwing around, Sully. You should see all this stuff. He's got files on every expedition to find Shambhala. All the way back to the 1600s. What about Marco Polo's journals? They are. Just hurry it up. You haven't got much time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The worthy pilgrim is granted a golden passport to conquer obstacles on his journey to Shambhala. Huh. Is that supposed to mean something? Beats me. Hold on. Here we go. It was with great sorrow that I left my fellow travelers to their fate. A fate decreed by the dreadful cargo we bore from Shambhala. Must have thought that tsunami was some kind of divine retribution. Wait a minute. Damn. Sully, I don't think the Chintamani Stone is here. What? Listen to this. I, I would have sooner endured the wrath of Kublai Khan himself than remove the Chintamani Stone from that sacred shrine. Marco Polo never had the stone. Then what dreadful cargo was he talking about? I don't know. Well, if the stone's not here, what the hell is Lazarovich looking for? Shambhala. Here in Borneo? It's a little wide of the mark, don't you think? He must be trying to pick up Marco Polo's trail. Back to Shambhala. Why? <laughs> because the stone is still there. <sighs> Chloe, can you talk? Hold on. Yeah, I'm here. In all this digging they've done, have they found any bodies, any remains at all? No, now that you mention it, nothing. Why? <laughs> Over 600 people were shipwrecked here, yet there's no bodies. Don't you find that a little odd? Go. Where would you go if a tsunami hit? High ground. To higher ground. Bingo. We head to that mountain. What do you bet we find Marco's pals? Chloe, can you meet up with us? Already on my way. Great. Uh oh. Nate, you gotta get out of there. <laughs> You're gonna have to give me a minute, Sully. You don't have a minute. What's this? They're all dead. Oh, crap. Uh oh. Stay down, kid. I got you covered. What the fuck? The body Nate. Over here. Well, hey, here we go. We have ourselves some grenades. Right. L2 to aim a grenade. And then tap L1 to throw. So that will get rid of those two there. And then L1 to aim. Coming at you. Right, that's a couple of them. There we go. Right, and now we've got the Wes gun, haven't we? So we can use that. If I could actually aim, that would then that'd be good. Whoa! What a, okay, where did you come from? I think you came from the right. What was that? All right, that got rid of one of them. Get your hands up. He didn't die from that. He was like, he was bloody ballet dancing. Right, that's Sully over there. Coming in on the left. Oh, Sully's actually directing the traffic. Eat this. Got rid of one of them. Coming down the middle. Nice headshot. Going well. Got rid of one. I think that one right. might still be alive. Yes, he is. I just said they're coming from. Ah, here you are. Sneak around this way if we can. 
Whoa. That was a bit... Oh, wow. Okay. I didn't know he could get me. Or maybe there was someone behind me. I don't know. Um, did we get a checkpoint from that? I don't know that we do. See you. Oh, I missed. There's more of them. Where is that coming from? Oh, that's solid. couple of explosions there. I think I might have um, got someone just as they were throwing a grenade. Might be able to go back for a couple more. No, we can't. Okay. this don't know oh hello need another uh what's that gun there we go oh, whoop, whoop. Try and get them with a the handgun. They're closing in on me. There we go. Any more? Oh, they're going after Sully, I think. I'm, I'm, I'm helping. I'm trying to anyway. I don't know if Sully can actually die. I don't know. He, I don't think he can. Let's go an aid up there. Actually, we just got one. That should be a triple whammy there. Nice. Triple whammy. Fall back. Okay. Going back this way. There's no more ammo up here though. Oh no, there is. We can get some more. Back up to four grenades. Another Wes gun. Right, where are they? Okay, there's one. Two wasted bullets. Three, four wasted bullets. That was a waste. I think I might have just shot between his legs as well. Oh, wait, who's that? Oh, that was close. Shit. Right, I've, oh, I've got no ammo. Shit. Shit. Help me, kid. You gotta take out the tower. D yeah, I'm a bit busy and I have I no ammo. Sorry. Right, let's 
get that health back. Cool. Right, is everyone else dead? I think they are. Right, so you've got to aim a grenade into there. Which I think I might have done it. There we go. Right, I think everybody's dead. We're good. Died a couple of times, but that was all round pretty good. Very good, in fact. Uh, let's just stock up on, on stuff, on uh, grenades and the like. All right, we've got 64. That's full. And we have 129, which is almost full. That should be good. All right, I think 120 is the max. Uh, can we get any more grenades? No, we have full grenades. We have full ammo. That's a good place to be in. And we have all Perlo, uh, Polos. Andrea Perlo, not Marco Polo. It's Andrea Perlo we're going after. We have all Marco Polo's bits and pieces. And uh, yeah, it looks like Lazarevich doesn't want the treasure. He wants to find the stone. He wants Shambhala. That's where he's going to. Um, and the Chitamani stone is... I guess like an equivalent would be like um, the, the Sorcerer's Stone or the Philosopher's Stone in like in Western stuff. Um, Should be this way. You know, you think like Harry Potter. Um, the Chintamani Stone is like an elixir. Basically, it can make the um, the possessor sort of almost immortal. So that's kind of what this stone is. Um, it has like, you know, those sort of abilities. So that's why he's after it, I guess. He wants that sort of... He wants that power. Um, I think I don't know if we'll crack on or if we'll end things off. Not quite sure. We might keep going for a bit. Maybe get to chapter five whenever that is. I'm not sure where we're oh, heading at sorry. the moment. Look at these stones. Ah, now we're somewhere. Oh yeah, I know where we are. It's this bit. <laughs> Would you look at that? Oh yeah. Up into the mountains. Hopefully, we'll find hey. a dead crew. And there's Hello. Chloe. We have here. It's got a yellow top this time, not Any a red luck. one. It's the last resting place of Marco Polo's crew. Shall we check it out? Right, is this going to be a new chapter? If so, I think we'll end uh, things off there. This must be thousands of years old, at least. Oh, it's very dark in here. Right, down we go. Is there an easy way down? down this way. Well, uh, no, not really. Like there is a way down there. Must be hundreds of bodies right. down here. Right. Uh, there's got to be treasure down here somewhere. So. They're all black. We'll see. They're all that way. Well, I found the they must crew. They must have taken refuge here during the tsunami. There's got to be some sort of clue around here. All right. Let's see what we can find. Um. Let's head this way a bit more. Sorry, Sally. I'm bumping into you. Uh, okay. I don't see anything that will be of use. I haven't found any treasure either. Oh God, bats! Jesus hey, I Christ! Think I found something. In here. What? They must have carried their cargo. It's a bit of resin all again. The way up here after they were shipwrecked. All right, let's just see what we can do with this then. Again, it, it acts as a UV light, so it might help us to see something. Resin. I've seen this before. Sully, give me a light. So the cigars coming in handy again. There we go. So the resin, um, when you light it, it acts as like a, a UV light, as you can see. You can see the dried blood. This is like if you go to a really, really bad hotel. All right, let's follow the blood stains. We'll see if they we get Gordon Ramsay in her. Just have a go at everyone about the blood. I say have a go. We'd absolutely flip off if there was blood like this in this, uh, in this hotel room. So if you follow this trail might lead us to something seems to end at this wall yeah 
That's odd. Can we get through? This moves a little. Sully, help me out. Here we go again with the pussy. I think I hurt myself. Ah, uh, you'll get over it. Right, what do we got? Okay, on no. Nope. Trail leads in here. The resin's still around. More the blood, rather. Well, there's lots of bones here. What happened to these people then? You know, maybe I'm crazy. But it looks like they all killed each other. Come on, mate. You're just getting spooked. I mean, how long were they here? How long were they here before they, you know, before they died? Months? Years? Wow. Look at this. What do we have here? Is that actually Marco? Christ almighty. <laughs> Just kidding. Nate, you're gonna give me a goddamn heart attack. Oh, what have we got here? Oh, Man, is oh we recognize that from the start of the what game. Is it some kind of weapon? No, no, it's a, a perba. That's the name Ritual for it. From Tibet. It's used to destroy obstacles. Huh? You know, spiritual ones. Oh. Wait a minute. Wait, could this be what Marco Polo was talking about? Kid, I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. In his journal, he wrote that uh, the worthy seeker would be given a golden passport to conquer obstacles on the journey to Shambhala. So, what, this is it? Look, that's all really interesting, but where the hell is it a passport to? Well, maybe this map would help. Let me see that. <laughs> Between Greater India and the province of Tibet lies a field of exquisitely finished temples. Hundreds of gilded spires stretching as far as the eye can see. Hold on, I know this place. It's in Nepal. Yeah. Weird it's flat place. Not just a field of temples anymore, it's a city. Well, that could make things a little more challenging. Now, hold on, there's more. In all these many temples, only one conceals the secret path to Shambhala. And that path shall only be revealed to the pilgrim who bears the golden passport. So that fur oh, perb is like I a key then. Kid. So what are we waiting for? Off to Nepal we Let's go. Little stop in Borneo, now we're off to Nepal. See ya. Was that actually Marco? I don't actually know. Maybe it wasn't. Let's get going. Alright, let's get out of here. Uh, oh, there she is. I'm gonna go out and make sure the coast is clear. I'll see you in a bit. Give me a hand, Nate. Uh oh. Damn it. Come on. Harry, in here. It's Drake. What the hell are Get your hands up. You sure know how to pick them. Shut up, Sonny. Should have known it was you. <laughs> and you, Victor Goddamn Sullivan. You still dragging D this tired <laughs> old sack of shit around? Easy, Nate. That's pretty ballsy for a guy who spent the last three months behind bars. Better than pissing away three months in the jungle without a clue. Found the ships, though, didn't I? You couldn't find your own ass with both hands. And a map. They came from down there. Whoa. Harry, look at this. Speaking of maps... Between India and Tibet... One temple will reveal a pathway path. to Shambhala. Jesus, Flynn, while we're young. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Don't be such a bad sport. Take them to Lazarevich. You're gonna wish you'd stayed in prison, mate. Move. So Flynn and Sully know each other as well, probably from a while ago. They probably don't see eye to eye. Right, Flynn's gonna go have a look down there. 
Come on, keep moving. Oh, Chloe got shot in the arm. Oh, shit. Are you all right? Yeah, well, it'll make it look more believable. Now I'm going to try and buy you some time. No, Chloe, you have to come with us. No. Just meet me in Nepal. Now run. That was a really Let's go. horrible. I like her. Yeah. That was like good. really horrible and wet. That was weird. All right. I guess Chloe had to kind they of spotted us. Point, had to, had to kind of shoot the gun, gun at us, otherwise they would have realised that she was double crossing us, or should have realised that she was working on the inside. So I don't think she really had a choice there, did she? Oh God! Um, oh, we're doing some platforming. Are we? Yeah, so she she kind of didn't have a choice, and then you know once she was clear, she yeah, she was able to to um. Able to see us clear, if that makes sense. Uh, damn. Now what do we do? We jump. <laughs> Hold on there, son bitch. You gotta be out of your mind. We'll break our goddamn necks. Yeah. We get caught, Lazarevich will break them for us. I'm getting too old. And everything else. Oh, come on. All right, Dan Danny Danny Glover. <laughs> Listen, I don't have your too old for this shit. Guys like me gotta know when to walk away from the table. Sully, we're gonna get out of this, okay? We always do. Yeah. You go meet your girl in Nepal. I'm going somewhere warm. Come on. Hey, you can tell me all about it when you get back. There they are! Oh, shit. Oh, Flynn's made his way out of the hole. Shall we? He is a hole. After you, Butch. See you in hell, kid. <laughs> well, there we go. Shit. Sorry, Flynn, we got away. Not sorry. Here we are in Nepal. When you said Lazarevich, Very quick stopping point here. I thought you we were there for longer. But well, he's had some help not. from the local guerrillas. The city's been on the brink of civil war for years. He just needed to throw a little gasoline on the fire. Charming. Yeah, well, all the chaos provides some cover while he destroys the city looking for the right temple. Nate? Hello? Yeah, I'm still here. You're not having second thoughts, are you? Oh, me? Never. Good, because I'm so ready to be done with these clowns. You got a map? Uh, yeah. I'll meet you in the old market. Things are pretty quiet over there. Alright, you got it. Um, we're going to leave things there. Uh, I don't, I don't want to um, play through this. I want to keep this for next time. Very quick stuff in Borneo. I thought, I, I seem to remember us being there for longer, but I guess we got through that quite quickly. And this one is going to be a bit longer than the first two, but I think the first two serve good as a sort of introduction. Uh, we're about 40, 45 minutes in, so I think we'll end things here. Um, we've just made our way to Nepal, so I think it's a good place to uh, good place to stop for now. So uh, hopefully you enjoyed that. If you did, drop a like down below and leave comments. If you haven't done so already, or if you're new, then do subscribe. Turn on notifications. Looks like Sully's going to be leaving us as well. Doesn't look like he's quite ready for this one. Um, and as he said, he's too old for this shit. He thinks he's Danny Glover. So, um, yeah, Sully looks like he's going to... Go and have himself a vacation. I'd love to do that as well. But, you know, Amber List, Red List, all that nonsense. Um, but, yeah, at least we know kind of what we're looking for, even though Flynn did manage to find us. And, you know, Chloe's kind of working as a, a sort of double agent at the moment. She's on our side, but, you know, she's still got to have favour with Lazarevich and with uh, and with Flynn. So, you know, I don't blame her for, ha you know, having to point the gun at us. That's kind of what you've got to do. Otherwise, they'll realise that she's... They'll realise that she's working for the other side. So, uh, yeah, I, I don't, I don't, I, I'm not going to have a go at her for that. Um, but, um, well, anything's there. Thank you for watching, and um, we'll pick it. We'll pick things up next time in the power. We'll look for this, uh, look for this temple that we need, and we have the key. We have the the perba to do so. So we'll pick things up next time. For now, thank you for watching, and I'll see you soon. Goodbye.